If you, for some reason, haven't realized yet, I love the Wii to death. Like, if anybody brings the Wii up, I will start to talk about every game I played on there. And it's a lot. And even my phone is Wii themed. But let me ask you a question. When you think of the Wii, you probably think of games like Wii Sports, Mario Galaxy, Skyward Sword, Mario Kart Wii, and Smash Brawl, right? Because those were pretty much the most popular games on the Wii, along with others. But there's probably one game that is in the back of your mind that you play as a kid, and that's Wii Fit. Wii Fit was basically an exercise game that helped you out with your weight, had fun games to help you exercise, and just stay fit. But if you're a gym rat and want to actually lose weight, I wouldn't recommend this game. But it's a fun game if you just want to have fun while working out. But Wii Fit also told you your weight, which made some people happy and some people mad, maybe including me. But we're going to talk about all of that in today's video. But before we get into it, consider subscribing and hitting that bell so you can get notified whenever I upload. I've also started streaming on YouTube, so make sure to have notifications on for that as well. I also might start streaming on Twitch soon. And also a little side note. There's an original Wii Fit and a Wii Fit Plus that came out two years after the original. So the footage you're going to see in this video is me playing Wii Fit Plus because it's literally just the same thing, just with more things added. Now, let's get into it. The original Wii Fit came out in late 2007 in Japan and spring 2008 in the USA. It didn't look like the game would sell well before, but to everyone's surprise, it sold 22.67 million copies worldwide, and it became the seventh best-selling Wii game. I think people bought it because it was different from everything that Nintendo has done in the past. An exercise game from Nintendo? I mean, who wouldn't want to try it out? Wii Fit came packaged with the then brand new balance board. It's the thing you use the whole entire game. You step on it, and that's basically it. That's the whole thing. Also, sorry if mine's a little dusty. I haven't touched this thing in like seven years. Now let's get into the actual game. When you first start up the game, the in-game talking Wii balance board will introduce itself. Then it'll tell you to introduce yourself, basically asking for your meat. It'll basically ask you for all the information they need to know about you, your height and your date of birth. Then it'll start a body test. If you, for some reason, don't know what a body test is in Wii Fit, it basically just measures you and tells you if you're fat or not. And oh my God, there's a little voice in the game that basically just straight up body shames you. <laughs> Because it'll say, oh, when you first step on a board, like you're about to break it or something. Like you really cannot make that stuff up. Starting up. Step on. Oh. Nintendo is really out here programming robots to body shame people. <laughs> and then not only do they do that, but if you're obese, it plays this low pitched sound and a robot girl talking about some, that's obese. <laughs> I cannot tell you how many times I've done the body test as a kid and it said obese. I was on the verge of tears. My mom always had to remind me that it was just a game and it's probably not accurate, but man did that give me a wake up call. I will literally think those training mini games would help me lose weight in like 30 minutes, but we're going to get into those in a minute. After the game literally calls you fat and body shames you, it lets you set a goal, whether you want to lose weight or gain weight, whether it's in two weeks, a month, two months, three months, or six months. If you want, the Wii Balance Board can give you two tests each time you take the body test. Basically just tests for your balance. And I think about one test for memory. It'll then give you your Wii Fit age. And a Wii Fit age is basically an age they use to see how fit you are in years. It could be under your actual age, over your actual age, or just your actual age. But if you are already set a goal and have passed up that goal, you just set another goal and then play the test if you want to see your Wii Fit age. You're done with the body test after all that. Now let's talk about the fun part. The mode I always used to play when I got on Wii Fit. The training mode. It welcomes you to this whole selection of mini games that will help you work out. It's split up into categories yoga, strength training, aerobics, and balance games. Yoga and strength training I really shouldn't have to explain. Yoga is just yoga. You do poses like the tree pose, downward facing dog pose, deep breathing, and more. Strength training is just you doing workouts like push ups, planks, squats, and more. But the games I used to play as a kid, and along with a lot of other kids, are the aerobics and balance games, what I like to call the fun games. Aerobics had games like hula hoops, step games, boxing, and more. And balance games, the category I used to play a lot, had games like soccer heading, ski jump, table tilt, and more. I like to believe that this is what most kids actually came on Wii Fit for. They didn't care if it was exercise, they just wanted to have fun, including me. I'm pretty sure when I first played this game, I didn't know it was an exercise game. It wasn't until I got older I realized what the body test actually was and what the game is actually about. I thought the game would actually help me lose weight. I mean, I guess it does in a way, but like, like I said, if you're a gym rat, Wii Fit will not help. Wii Fit is more of a family workout oriented game, and that's why it did so well, so families could work out and play together. And speaking of doing so well, it did well enough when Nintendo decided to add on to it with a whole other game, Wii Fit Plus. 
Like I said in the beginning, We Fit Plus came out two years after the original in fall 2009 everywhere. At first glance, it may not look like the same thing, but once you get into it, you realize, hey, this is kind of different. And also, I found out not too long ago that if you already have data from the original We Fit, We Fit Plus will automatically take the saved data from the original and bring it over. I don't know why I just realized that. I mean, it makes sense. And when that happens, the balance board will just tell you about the new things you can do in this new Plus version. But instead of a board telling you what's new, I'll tell you instead. In this new version, you can now register pets and babies, but they obviously can't do any of the training modes. A new mode called My We Fit Plus was added where you can make your own routines or go by one of the game's routines. You can now do multiplayer where you switch out people every time a turn is over. And of course, the biggest thing is the new mode added to the training mini games, Training Plus, which added 15 brand new mini games. While it's not a sequel, it did a pretty good job expanding on the original, and the new mini games aren't bad either. It also got some new yoga and strength training workouts, but everything else is pretty much the same. Except in Wii Fit, some of the things are blue, but everything in this game has been changed to green. But the trainers haven't changed, the menus haven't changed, and the body sets still cause kids fat, so everything is normal. This was pretty successful as well, but it took Nintendo a while to release the next game in the series for the Wii U, Wii Fit U. Wii Fit U came out in fall 2013, everywhere, four years after Wii Fit Plus. Almost everything is different now. Of course, with the game being on the Wii U, the game tries to use the Wii U gamepad in a lot of different ways. You can now take pictures with the gamepad while it's measuring you for the body test. New mini games using the gamepad, the menus got a whole new upgrade. In training mode, there's one brand new category called dance where you use two Wii Motion Plus controllers and just dance along with the instructor. It's kind of weird but fitting for an exercise game. Hmm, didn't know I was playing Just Dance though. It also adds some new mini games while some are for Wii Fit Plus, but some mini games from Wii Fit Plus didn't make it over for some reason. It's basically the sequel to Wii Fit, not some sort of add-on. There's also this little accessory called the Wii Fit Meter. It works like a little step kind of thing you can take with you on the go. I thought this was the coolest thing and I just brought it along everywhere with me for a while until I lost it. This is honestly my favorite game in the whole entire series. It brings old and new together. I mean, they did a fine job with this game in my opinion. And that was my video on Wii Fit. This game was my childhood. I mean, I love to play those mini games and especially the basic and advanced step mini games. Those were my favorite. Comment down below what your favorite memory of Wii Fit was. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more like this, consider subscribing and hitting that bell so you get notified whenever I upload. And make sure to follow all my socials that are on screen right now. All links will be in the description. And like I said in the beginning, I'll be going live on YouTube recently. So make sure you have notifications on for that. And I will see you in the next one. Peace.